Good morning. Good morning. I am recording this pretty late. <laughs> My throat is a little bit annoying. I think it's because I've been laughing so much today. I've been together with the family all day. It's been so nice. But it does mean that my voice <laughs> or my throat, I don't know. I hope it's just because I've been laughing a lot. I ain't got time for fitness. But I wanted to do a reading today on Monday so that you guys have it ready for tomorrow. One, one, one with that. Hello. I'm trying to see what oracle we're going to start out with. There might be something about a song that's significant today. Either it's a song someone is sending you, or it's a song that you're listening to. It could be an old song, uh, yeah, a song that you are that you know. Do you hear it? Like maybe it has a specific specific meaning. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> Because I want to use the sacred destiny. Okay. Let's see. Might be a short one today. Nonetheless. I mean yesterday, right? Or, yeah. No? Yeah, yesterday. Yesterday, yeah. The week ahead reading. I did see the relaxation card. So maybe there's something about relaxation. It's actually back. Oh, the colors are fitting well. I, by the way, saw the moon today, and my god, it's massive. It is massive, but that's also what they said, right? <laughs> Talking about the moon. That's also what they said about this Aries. <laughs> this Aries full moon. It's going to be very bright, very big. Anyway, one thing I do want to mention, because I actually didn't realize that. I thought that we were already in this energy of... Plutibu being in Aquarius. Apparently not. Not until the 19th of November. So we are still experiencing the tests. So I was wrong about that. It is thanks to my friend Sunny who pointed it out when I talked with her. I haven't talked with her. Oh yeah, that's... Oh, that's something. I haven't talked with her for a year, but I had a dream where I talked with her over the phone and... I felt like something was wrong, so I asked her what was wrong, but she kept talking over the phone about butterflies that she was seeing, like she kept talking about butterflies, so I wrote that to her and she was like, oh my god girl, last night I had a dream about you too and there was butterflies in it, I was like, oh my god, <laughs> pay attention to some cities today, but what is the energy of today, spirit, what is the energy of today? <gasps> Miracles. I mean, it is the theme of the week ahead, right? Double rainbows. Maybe there's something about double rainbows. I mean, this is your double rainbow. It's all happening, even if um, Capricorn is still in Pluto. Double rainbow. After the storm, the rainbow appears, no matter where we are. That's true. No matter what you're going through, no matter where you are. The storm of the past are passing, and your dreams are coming true. Well, there you go. If that's not a confirmation from yesterday's reading, no matter what has happened in the past, your future holds abounding, abounding, <laughs> abounding, abounding miracles, good fortune, celestial beauty, and inner divinity is expanding within you. One thing I just got in is that no matter what your situation is, if there is frustration, if there is a setback, trust the process. No matter how lost the case seem, or how frustrated you are about something, keep a positive outlook, because it is going to happen, okay? Very important but today just the whole week ahead believe that your life is guided trust in the goddess of the universe a celestial bridge to the heavens <laughs> to the heavens is opening for you start a health program invest in your career or initiate a relationship and good fortune will manifest blessings are flowing in all directions. Believe that you deserve the best because you do. 
bounty, joy, blessings, and miracles are flowing your way. Hello. Hello, people. With that, now I have to... Do I have all the cards? Actually, where is the brown deck that I love to use? <laughs> the brown deck. Oh, it's here. I haven't used it for a while. This is your intuition. Seven two six. Seven two six. I was guided to look that up. Brings a message of love, encouragement, and support from your angels. Trust that your everyday material monetary needs will be met as you persist pers <laughs> persistently <laughs> journey along your life path, living your soul purpose and destiny. Yeah, there is positive abundance flowing into your life. This fits very well to what we got told before. This number encourages you to be positive and optimistic about the material aspect of your life. Your positive affirmation and optimistic attitude, as well as your faith and trust in the in the the universe in the universal energies, will ensure that all of your needs will be met in divine right time. Use your life for your highest good. It's connected with number six, so maybe number six is actually a number that's going to pop up today. I mean, listen to your intuition. Your dreams are coming true. You're very close. There's a lot of healing in these miracles coming your way. We spoke about that yesterday too. Believe and trust, 919, that this is actually going to be the best week in your life. It is the beginning of the new. Even if there might still be tests from Pluto and Capricorn, but a lot of you guys have already overcome it. You already know what you want. And you understand the aspects of tests. You, you, um, how can I say that? You understand that what you deserve deserves you. <laughs> okay, don't know where it comes from. What you deserve deserves you. That's a wow saying. That while while we have three of cups, ten of cups, well, celebration, happiness, and family all around. Family might be something with dating. Or just hanging out with people again, also seasonal, right? Like Halloween and Christmas time, it's going to be filled with love and happiness and everything. Okay, 10 10. Better believe in it, my love. 10. Yeah. Yeah. For some of you guys, there's something about a fight that's ending, a mental blocks, mental fights, the ego battle. <laughs> that's ending. Ego death, that's what I want to say. Why do I want to do that, that again? It might be something with a message today. We did have something with a phone call yesterday, right? Or an important incoming text or conversation. Might have happened in the weekend, past weekend. All right, what is the energy with the miracles? Ooh, Knight of Swords. 11-11, well, there you go. Wow, you're really being pushed into something big. This is big change coming your way. It's fast change. Knight of Swords is fast. He's very strategic. He's very determined. He knows where he's going. There's no confusion in whatever happens today. It's just like, I see where I want to go, and I go there. It's like all stoplights turning green. That is this kind of uh, energy. I mean, again... Miracles, right? Whatever it is, it is that you're setting your mind to today, it's you're succeeding. Again, like the week ahead, right? You're manifesting. What is the guidance today with this? Well, the guidance is being guided, so you're being very heavily guided today. By a spirit team, it's obviously also a card of balance in a moment where you might feel confused. It is interesting with this card because you can see the crown, right? Like you can in the normal tarot. But you're most definitely taking a very balanced approach when it comes to a situation today, a balanced approach. So if there is something coming up where you're like, I don't know if I can, you know, can I, can I do this? Can I trust this? You're taking a balanced approach, balancing yourself out and <laughs> approaching. Let's see what the, um, the outcome is. Information. 
justice is always a yes card. So if it appears after a confirm after confirmation, after you spoke something, said something, a hum moment, whatever, it is a confirmation. What is the energy? And what is the energy at hand? Oh, there you go. That was a meaning why I needed to look at that. Oh my god. There's something about law of a career. So you guys, again, law of a career. It's going very fast, but it's a balanced approach, whatever this is. Balanced approach, I'm saying. <laughs> I'm saying keep having faith in your manifestations because they are coming. But balanced, natural approach. What is the outcome of today? Oh, that was a twister. <laughs> well, some of you guys are getting a love offer. A very sweet one. A little shy one, maybe even. If it's not love, 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 love. I love that. I love that. Whoever is approaching you, it's a very balanced approach. It might be a little shy approach, but it's a very positive approach. It's like something is being offered to you today from someone else. And for some of you guys, yeah, it could be love. It could be your boyfriend or girlfriend doing something sweet for you if you are in a relationship. If it's someone new, well, maybe they are doing something new. Maybe it's a text message. Maybe it's a call. Maybe it's, I don't know, maybe, I don't know, if you're going on a date, maybe it's flowers or chocolate. Who knows? But it's a balanced approach. It's very balanced. Very balanced. Mm. Could also be career, right? Maybe a staff member well, maybe staff member or a client um, colleague is you know leaving something at your desk like like chocolate there apparently is something about chocolate today <laughs> or something something very sweet could be a crush someone who has a crush on you maybe something about a letter <laughs> yeah yeah Wow, someone is taking action today. Someone is keeping an eye on you today. Ooh, someone is taking action. Maybe not today, because again, we do have the temperance. And they are facing the past. Oh, they're facing the past. It, well, it's not. it doesn't mean that nothing is happening. Something could happen. But I am paying attention to that they are facing the other way. So maybe someone is like trying to think about an approach but a balanced approach so you guys might experience this today or you will experience it later this week or whenever but the night is very fast so but also the, te the temperance the emperor is very determined right he doesn't take action if he's not 100 percent sure so with these cards also the page of swords there is still this energy of like looking into something what is the bitch bitch what is the best approach in a situation you could be the one thinking about that or someone else could even the page is actually also looking into the direction of a there's two offers yeah it's like someone is waiting for you to take action maybe you know what this is for you nice today is going to be very interesting of uh, the underlying energy of what is happening right the underlying energy yeah yeah don't jump into a competitive mind when it comes to making a decision or looking into a situation you know don't do it in the normal way you know Does that makes sense don't approach something in the normal way no. Thank you. Have a magical day with miracle, miracle, miracles and love, love, love. Love, love. love. And career, career, career. Money, money, money. Bye.